Vlad Levitt here, and let's talk about the monarchy. We're gonna pretend that the monarchy is still relevant because when TMZ is a reliable source and updates about the royal family I think it's time to hand in the gloves. There should be no queens and princes in 2018 It just sounds silly to me. It just seems like a giant game of make-believe. All right, you're a queen uh, You're a prince. He's a wizard. Stop playing games and get it together Britain Actually, I'll give you this much. I think Queen Elizabeth makes sense. Like she was there during World War II She's 900 years old her face looks like it belongs on currency. But after the queen dies, that's it. No more monarchy. They already messed up by referring to William and Harry as princes. They should have just called them Bill and Harry. Um, don't you mean Prince William? Oh yeah. We should call you that. Will you? No. Why? You're asking too many questions, Bill. When will you make this stop, Britain? When Bruno Mars gets knighted? Because then it would be too late. And I understand it's a very hard transition to make. It's kind of like a breakup after a relationship that lasted almost a thousand years. But I think it's time to move on and explore other options. You don't have to commit right away. Just get up and talk to friends. What do you have to lose? I hear she had a pretty long thing with the monarchy too. Apparently it didn't really end on good terms. And like I said, I understand it's a very drastic change to make. My suggestion, we slowly replace members of the royal family with a cast of Downton Abbey. I promise it's gonna take a while before the rest of the world catches on. And that's it. Once again, if you enjoy the video, don't forget to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook at Vlad Levitt. And I'll see you guys next time.